Today, we will delve into the fascinating world of radiology and explore the various advanced imaging techniques used in the evaluation and treatment of kidney stones. The field of radiology has made tremendous advancements in recent years, revolutionizing our ability to accurately diagnose and monitor kidney stones. In this script, we will discuss 12 key topics, each offering detailed insights into the role of imaging techniques in stone analysis and treatment. So, let us begin our journey into the cutting-edge world of radiology and its implications in the management of kidney stones. Stone composition analysis is vital in treating kidney stones. By using dual energy CT, doctors can accurately determine the chemical composition of a stone, such as calcium oxalate or uric acid. This helps in creating personalized treatment plans and reducing the chance of stone recurrence. Three-dimensional, 3D, reconstruction is a powerful tool that enhances our understanding of kidney stone anatomy and aids in treatment planning. By creating a virtual model of the urinary system, we can visualize the size, location, and spatial relationship of stones in relation to surrounding structures. This information guides urologists in determining the most appropriate intervention, be it extracorporeal shock wave lithotripsy or endoscopic stone removal. Additionally, 3D reconstruction improves communication between the radiologist and the urologist, fostering a multidisciplinary approach to stone management. Virtual non-contrast imaging is a technique that allows us to obtain valuable information about kidney stones without the need for contrast agents. Traditionally, contrast-enhanced imaging has been employed to assess urolithiasis. However, in certain patient populations, such as those with impaired renal function or allergies to contrast agents, virtual non-contrast imaging offers a safe and effective alternative. By utilizing various image reconstruction algorithms, virtual non-contrast imaging generates images that mimic the appearance of unenhanced scans, allowing for accurate stone detection and characterization. Dual Source Computed Tomography CT, imaging is a breakthrough technology that revolutionizes the evaluation of kidney stones. With its unique dual source scanner configuration, this technique enables rapid acquisition of high-resolution images with reduced radiation exposure. Dual source CT is particularly advantageous in patients with elevated body mass index, BMI, or those with renal colic, as it yields images of excellent diagnostic quality even in the presence of motion artifacts. Moreover, the ability to acquire low-dose scans without compromising diagnostic accuracy makes dual source CT an invaluable tool in stone imaging. Artifacts in imaging can hinder accurate interpretation and lead to diagnostic errors. In the context of kidney stone evaluation, artifacts can obscure stone detection and characterization. To overcome this challenge, radiologists have developed various artifact minimization techniques. These techniques include advanced image reconstruction algorithms, such as iterative reconstruction, which mitigates artifacts caused by high-density stones, beam hardening, and patient motion. By employing these techniques, radiologists can improve diagnostic confidence and enhance the accuracy of stone analysis. Digital tomosynthesis is an emerging imaging modality that offers significant benefits in the evaluation of kidney stones. By acquiring a series of low-dose X-ray images at different angles, digital tomosynthesis creates a tomographic reconstruction of the urinary system. This technique provides a clearer and more focused view of the stones, reducing the impact of overlying structures and enhancing diagnostic accuracy. Digital tomosynthesis is especially advantageous in patients with complex stone burdens or those with overlapping calcifications, where traditional radiographic imaging may be less informative. Diffusion Weighted Imaging DWI, is a magnetic resonance imaging MRI, technique that has shown promise in the evaluation of kidney stones. By measuring the random motion of water molecules, DWI provides valuable information about the cellular architecture and composition of stones. This technique enables differentiation between different stone types, such as cysteine and calcium oxalate, which have distinct diffusion patterns. Moreover, DWI can aid in identifying associated complications, such as obstruction or infection, contributing to a comprehensive assessment of kidney stone disease. Shock wave lithotripsy, SWL, is a non-invasive treatment modality widely used for kidney stone management. Image guidance plays a crucial role in ensuring accurate targeting of stones while minimizing collateral damage to surrounding tissues. Advanced imaging techniques, such as fluoroscopy or ultrasound, provide real-time visualization of stone fragmentation during SWL. This allows the urologist to adjust the focus and energy of the shock waves, optimizing treatment efficacy. Additionally, image guidance facilitates the detection of treatment-resistant stones, prompting timely intervention with alternative modalities. Minimally invasive endoscopic techniques have revolutionized the management of kidney stones, offering an alternative to open surgery. Endurological procedures, such as ureteroscopy and percutaneous nephrolithotomy, 
rely heavily on imaging guidance for precise stone localization and efficient stone removal. With the aid of advanced imaging modalities, urologists can navigate the urinary tract, visualize stone fragments, and ensure complete stone clearance. This minimally invasive approach reduces patient morbidity, shortens hospital stays, and accelerates postoperative recovery. Ureteric colic is severe flank pain caused by kidney stones. Imaging techniques like CT urography and ultrasound help diagnose the condition. These techniques show the blocked urinary tract, stone details, and associated problems. Choosing the right imaging method is key for effective patient care. Following stone treatment, radiological evaluation is essential to assess the effectiveness of the intervention and determine the presence of residual fragments. Various imaging techniques, including CT, ultrasound, and X-ray, can be employed to evaluate stone clearance. Radiologists meticulously review these images, quantifying the size and number of residual stones and assessing their potential for future clinical complications. Accurate post-treatment assessment allows clinicians to promptly address any stone remnants, reducing the risk of recurrence and associated morbidity. In kidney stone imaging, minimizing radiation exposure is important. Radiologists use lower dose protocols, reconstruction algorithms, and proper slice thickness to balance diagnostic quality and radiation risk. These techniques reduce radiation burden on patients without sacrificing accuracy. In conclusion, radiology's advanced techniques have revolutionized kidney stone management. From analyzing stone composition to reducing radiation exposure, these topics deepen our understanding of radiology's role in treatment. By combining these techniques with a multidisciplinary approach, we can provide personalized care and prevent stone recurrence. With ongoing advancements, radiology will continue to enhance the diagnosis and treatment of kidney stones.